to meet you. Tickety. Tickety. Yeah, tickety. Just like tickety, tickety. Yeah. Um, nice. So, what's your name again? Very nice. I, I won't forget this time, okay? Yeah, so you just moved out today. Yeah, from the old place. Because I've never seen you here before. If I saw someone like you, I wouldn't forget. Nice, very cool. Cool, very cool. Um, is it okay if I just maybe like grab it? I feel a little nervous. <laughs> You have like a very beautiful face. Makes me like a little shy. Uh, so where are you from? Oh, cool. Me? Uh, I'm from Canada. So as how do you like this place? Do you like this room? I am a little messy. I, I stay a little messy, but uh, I'll try to clean better if you want me to. Because, um, yeah, just like that's my downside. I always stay super messy. Mm -hmm. Cool. Um, I'm very nervous, but uh, yeah, I'd like to know, know about you. Uh, so, how is your first impression coming here? Yeah, cool. Did you meet um, more people? Did you make any friends? Very cool. <laughs> yeah, can I? get closer to you. I want to see you closer. Nice, thank you. Wow, you're really beautiful. Cool. God, I want to touch your face a little bit. Sorry, I shouldn't have. Thank you. I'll just gentle touch your chin. You're very beautiful. Your nose and your eyes. Who do you look like? Your dad or mom? Really? That's really cool. Are they both good looking like you? Like you. I'll lay down and now I'm gonna listen to you. Oh, I'd like to lay down. Okay, feels much more comfortable. So, tell me about yourself and what made you just come here. Nice. Very cool. Um, it's like how different than your expectation. Mm -hmm. Yeah, fair enough. Do you have siblings? No? Yeah? Any fast food? Like what's your favorite food? Okay. Mine too. <laughs> Funny. <laughs> nice. Um, and also like um, to know like I I really not I don't feel comfortable when the room is too cold and. 
if it's okay if I like keep the temperature around 25 degrees when it's too cold I feel like very uncomfortable and uh, makes me miss my home to someone like you and my roommate uh, just before you I had only one roommate and um, the person left because the spouse was like uh, get in the new place something like that or like they were just moving together um, yeah I don't, I don't remember fully full details but uh, I was so worried if I'm gonna be alone <laughs> Great, um, that's very nice Do you sleep early? Yeah, like uh, around what time? Oh, yeah, me too Yeah that's really cool. Um, also, I was wondering, can we, maybe like we should go out for dinner or something, like once a week, if you don't mind, just hang out. Okay. Uh, do you have a girlfriend? Also, that's great. I didn't wanna I like didn't wanna be in trouble to keeping you late. You seem very attractive and yeah <laughs> and um just I didn't want to be in trouble. I'm a chicken, that's right. Um, and another thing I was wondering, like, uh, do you go, do you, like, plan to go back or, like, visit your family? Oh, sounds like airplane, right? Yeah, you visit, you planning? No? Okay, yeah? Okay, yeah. That's good. Um, I hope there's not much noise during night time. I, I'm not a good sleeper. I actually like super light sleeper. I wake up a lot. I hope I won't make, wake you up. <laughs> um, did you remember? Did you like memorize my name? I'm Tickety, you remember? Tickety, yeah. Well, the name is Libby, but I like Tickety better. No, it's not like better, just um, sound cooler, I would say. More like Tickety, 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 like Chickety, Tickety. Just um, this name. Um, no, I was just thinking something like more, like a clicky soundy thing. That's why I chose it. <laughs> uh, have you seen the laundry downstairs? That has a uh, charge like three quarters and a uh, one big loan which is like Canadian one dollar so one load is like dollar seventy five I was thinking I also found like one trick or well, I'll tell you so before you put the coin in all of the coin uh, put the sticky tape around it okay and then 
put the coin in, push, but then pull it back. So the machine doesn't take the coins. And you can just get it. Don't tell them that I told you. It's only between you and me. Because I'll be in trouble. I don't want to be in trouble. <laughs> yeah. Um, and uh, was also there's another another trick was um, downstairs also I like a dryer right when somebody's drying the clothes take it out and put it in put yours in so yeah I know it's so mean but uh, it's just too expensive <laughs> and uh, we're sharing the room too, right? And why not we're doing it together? <laughs> Part of the crime. We should do that. Yeah. And what else I know this place? Uh, oh yeah. So the landlord lives in the basement. Yeah, he lives with us. And then like if you make a noise after midnight, come upstairs and like knock the door right away. So we're gonna be like careful. And if you're late or like if I'm late, um can you like open the door for me quietly? Um uh, nice, can I have your phone number if you don't mind? Okay, I'll grab my phone. My mom just asked me if I'm in my room yet. <laughs> I want to talk about you to my mom if you like when I and you like have a chance because you're very interested. <laughs> and um, also, like, she asks, like, hi, you know, like, little child all the time. Does your mom do that to you? Yeah. Very nice. How do you feel about it? Yeah. Cool. Um, do you think the room is okay for you? What do you think about it? Um, so, 
in a new place with a new roommate uh, what do you like about me? <laughs> so straightforward um, I feel the same about you um, I really like you actually from the first time we're looking at it really liked you yeah I'm so excited and can't wait to like spend more time with you in the room nice right I've never been that excited before and um, I'm so excited <laughs> yeah this light makes my day look so hard. I don't know <laughs> It's gonna blind your eyes <laughs> uh, Trust me, it's not like this bleached white <laughs> um, um, So, do you watch any like a TV show or something? to watch Walking Dead a lot like all season at least I watched three times yeah that was fun yeah and um, we should watch together the new TV show that's been on on HBO have you heard that? yeah me too we should do that. We have so many similarities. Yeah. Nice. I'm excited. Um, so, I want to ask you one thing then. If you think I'm cool, um, do you want to go out for breakfast with me tomorrow morning? Yay, great. Um, I'll let you sleep now and then we're gonna go out tomorrow. What do you think? Yeah, nice. Um, I don't know if I can sleep though. I'm just still wired up. I'm like super wired up and then so excited. Um, I'm very excited to like share a room with you. Uh, oh yeah, what's, what's, what's your plan? Like, how long are you gonna stay here? Okay Oh, are you gonna stay longer for me, please? Well, that's only first day, but I really like you It's, um, it's like my first impression and, uh, like, uh, everything was So, uh, I can't even express it. It was like, they were all so amazing. Yeah. Well, then we should definitely go out for breakfast tomorrow. And then, um, I also like heard there's gonna be some festival this weekend. And, um, I wanna take you show you around since you've never been here does it sound okay? okay, nice um, and do you have anything to ask from me? no oh, come on <laughs> not interested came like from far place and it's a new place 
sitting, settling up and I'm talking so much, not letting you relax I, I don't usually talk this much, don't get me wrong, but um, I'd like to spend time with you, I wouldn't uh, I wouldn't want to like uh, make you feel tired or like run away from me <laughs> but can't wait to talk even more okay I'll let you sleep then uh, then um, um, I'll wake you up in the morning so we can go out for breakfast and I can take you around the neighborhood okay sound good good night can I touch your face again please thank you subscribe gosh oh my god hey how are you oh, it's lightning it's crazy I was waiting for you and um you see, I have things on my bed and um, I, I thought you're gonna come earlier before the thunderstorm No? Aww, too bad I thought you lost in the new city <laughs> Yeah Well, since you're home I'll tell you what my plan is tonight Okay, and so I know you've been like stressed a lot and it's a new place, new city, new roommate, you know so I planned nice cozy bedtime routine for you what do you think? good? nice, nice so I got this cool very long matches it's like uh, my nose itchy it says 40 matches so we can use it a lot okay well anyways I'll leave them here and we're gonna start okay and just pour you let me check on you just a sec you're like full covered in rain oh my goodness poor you oh silly goose you are I thought I lost you like you just came and then I lost you in a new city to someone else <laughs> okay let me check just a sec how are you feeling? like you feeling good? just um, a lot of water around you you're soaking wet okay, good um, and now I'm gonna show you another lightning I'm glad you're here with me though
We're gonna use it, okay? Keep away from children. You told me I have a couple questions from you. You told me you're gonna have breakfast together. You didn't come, what happened? Oh, really? Oh no, I'm so sorry. I thought you just didn't want to come. I'm so sad. I was really sad. Okay, now I am. Ooh, it's like that. That's so serious. Come on, right? Wow. Nice wood sound. Be very careful. <laughs> I'm a bit scared. Such, such silly girl. <coughs> Let's put it back in those. Where is the... It's right here. So, the reason I got matches candle and smell smell good right smell really good that was just flashing I thought it's gonna okay this one says cashmere. Cashmere. Okay. Other one. Actually, build on me on breakfast. Now you're calling me for lunch, date? Um, sure. That sounds great. This one is cedar, balsam cedar. Oh, that's strong. Okay. Should do it, right? <laughs> wow. 
Let's turn it on. How do you suppose to turn it on? It's not even working. So I'm gonna use it. Good. I can't start it. Okay. That's dangerous. <laughs> okay. Put it on. Is it cold? Should be cold. I will put it up there and I'm gonna put the candles on the dresser, okay? I'll put it on the dresser and we can have some nice smelling. Tea for you. Okay, I'll wait. This one here. I have tea. You can have your own choice of tea. After a thunderstorm, you soaked wet. We should pamper you before bedtime. feels like I've only met you first time. I don't know why. So, these ones are all actually a little bit caffeine in it. Would you mind? But it will make you feel warm, cozy, energized, and also feeling loved. I'm also wondering what will happen if you drink the tea 
is supposed to feel love, like loved by someone. Do you want to try that one? Let me find it for you. been waiting for you all day and I saw the weather forecast it says it's gonna rain and I was worried like to be honest I was worried I didn't want you to feel too cold you know that's why I was waiting for you outside with umbrella but um somehow we missed each other Oh, you use the back door. That makes sense. Yeah. Oh. I'm glad you're home in the room together. I mean, okay. Ready. using I know right I thought it would sound cooler than kettle too anyway so I asked them, the neighbor to boil the water for me, put it in the thermos since the landlord didn't want to give me anything. Stupid. I shouldn't say it, right? But you won't tell him anyways. I trust you. I fully trust you. You know that? some hot water. It's very hot. You have to be careful though. it. It's 
get a girl like up. Since your roommate is a girl, there's no other choice. You, are you sure about the lunch? Because you bailed on me. <laughs> okay. Well, I'm glad. I'm, I'm actually so relieved to hear that. I thought you didn't like me. And, um, yeah. <laughs> I was feeling dumb at the time. Like, I waited for you and then I was like, just embarrassed. It's okay. I forgive you. Yeah. I fully forgive you. closer to you. It's so nice to see your face and um, touching your nose and your lips. It's so beautiful. Okay, mm, I'm gonna show you a couple things you're gonna choose, okay? <laughs> Sound good? Okay. Um, I have, you know, I like, I have all the girl stuff. I have two. Which one would you like? This or that? Like, I'll show you this. This one. brush, okay?
Okay, let's try like that a little bit. here I think I got like the first time <laughs> when I first saw you I really liked you instantly that was like unexpected act for me I usually like to talk to people and you know but with you the feeling was different very different from the very first moment. I really like to be with you and share in the room. Which one would you like? Or this or that? Which one? This one? it on a little bit. That's okay. I'm here. Try to relax. I'm not gonna leave you alone, okay? I'll be here.
I waited for you so long and I'm tired. Can I give you a hug? You feel so warm. Can I hug you again? your face this or that this okay let's put it down and like brush your face brush 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 Brush, 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 brush. Gently blow feeling good nice I can't get enough touching your face <laughs> that's so like beautiful so perfect I think you're the one like actually the very first person I Instantly thought so attractive. And well, being with you makes me feel so relaxed, and um, I'm like very relaxed. Can I give you another hug? Thank you. You smell so good. What did you use? You smell really good. Really? That's sneaky. <laughs> really good one. Okay, this one away. This one away. Now, I have two things. I was planning to like massage your back. 
You'll never find a roommate like me, actually. So keep me. <laughs> okay. So this one I have. Okay. Let's see. Maybe like that. This Which one? This or that? This or that? This or that? That? Okay. Okay, I'll hug you and then I'll do massage your back. Okay. Does it feel good? <laughs> mm, how are you feeling? I feel like I'm doing massage for you and pampering you, but I'm same time feeling so relaxed and ready to sleep. face with uh, my favorite treatment it's like make a sleepy kind of droplets <laughs> Let's 
Da. so tired. <laughs> I hope you had a good time with me. <laughs> I can't wait to launch date and um Just always remember I'm here, okay? <laughs> okay. Good night. I'm here, coming over. Um, yeah, come in. There's a seat if you want to take it. So, what's up? I thought you were bailing on me again. Mm. Well, you know, it's different. We're finally on a date. Right? <laughs> this ring, um... I'll do it here. I just like 
victim wear it because sometimes people bother you know and when you wear double rings they don't yeah um anyways so how did you come did you take bus walk oh yeah nice you wanna ask a question for me sure Okay, you wanna start? Where did I learn German? Oh, I learned it at university Just for fun, you know Yeah <clears throat> Well, and it's like um, Just um, I wanted to try new things, so that's how I started it and my favorite word in German um, I like Entschuldigung <laughs> it's like excuse, sorry I would say, right? Entschuldigung it just sounds so fun how about you? what's your favorite? it can be anything Okay, I'm also like, you know, do you think I speak so fast or slow? Yeah, I prefer like speak slow for sure Because when I try to speak fast, sometimes I'm like blah 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 blah, you know <laughs> So, yeah, that's how I do it <laughs> I'm like slow speaking and um, uh, can I get a ginger ale, please? What are you gonna get? Huh. Nice. Oh, thank you. So, I like rain sound for sure. You know, rain, ocean sound. How about you? Yeah? So we're very close. Um, is that a chair make a noise? I guess. Oh, that's funny. Do you have any favorite channel? Tell me about yourself. Oh, this chair is so annoying. I need to change it Do you have any favorite channel? Oh, really? So my favorite channel is I don't know, have you ever heard um, Maria? She does I, uh, I think she does ASMR videos on YouTube You know, I like you some more videos uh, Yeah, I think her channel name is Gentle Whispering I like it And I'm also like, oh, you know Wondering, like, since we were in the roomies You didn't tell me about yourself Have you, like, traveled anywhere, you know? Oh, nice! What was your most favorite place to visit? Really? That's neat! Um, me? <laughs> um, I would say the places I've been visited I would say Philippines, Boracay um, that was the that was number one for me and um and then Turkey the Garim it's a uh, Garim um yeah that was it's like a you know like a big it's like a big rock um like very big rock cave 
the hotel is in a cave, yeah. So they built a hotel in the cave. That was very nice. Ah, oh, ginger ale, thank you. Let me open it. take my eyes off of you <laughs> so do you, do you have like yeah the green I was talking right um, yeah that was beautiful it's like a cave and the hotel is in the cave that was nice uh, how about the books do you like to read yeah I like to read till um what type of book do you like to read? Thank you. So, do you like? This is our first official date, actually. Um, do you like laughing date or like serious? Really? <laughs> Me too. I I like laughing, like a light date for sure. It's more fun. Um, and you don't have to worry about, you know, tension, tight feeling, right? <laughs> um, how about the places you want to visit? Where do you want to go? Do you have any plan or like any dream? Really? That's one of the places I like to visit for sure. Yeah. Um, mine is. I'd like to try. I mean, like I'd like to visit Europe. I think it's very beautiful there. And um, I like uh, historical places and also like, yeah, beach. You know, forest. I like them. And um. Maybe Scotland or like England or like um, I also like to visit Norway. I think it's very beautiful there. Yeah, you're so cute. <laughs> How do I look? Do you think I look good? I. Did it for you. <laughs> I know we live in the same room. It's so hard to like sneak and do things, right? 
Um, so, what about music? Do you like? What genre of music do you like to listen? Oh really? I'm drinking ginger ale I'm just showing YouTube <laughs> Cause they're gonna, f they're gonna flag it Um, sorry, I stopped you Yeah, what genre of music do you like to pl listen? almost everything yeah I listen to almost everything though the most gangster rap <laughs> yeah and um, the concert I've been um, the best concert I've been to a black pink concert oh that was really good Blackpink was one of the like the best concert I've ever been to. Yeah. Um I love Blackpink and Jenny so much. <laughs> yeah. Um also I was going to ask like um how about have you ever have have, have like any mm, you know like Weird craving. Tell me about it. I like to listen. <laughs> what? Really? That's funny. Um, no, I've never heard that before. That's insane. You're silly. Oh, well, me, um, on here, really? Like, 100%. Okay, then I'll tell you. My favorite, um, snack is, like, weird snack, I would say. I like to dip Twix chocolate bar and a condensed milk in it that's my favorite also it's weird and I think people call it weird uh, it, it's it's delicious you should try it actually we should try it right like you and me we should try it together I would love to try it with you <laughs> I'll ask okay. excuse me uh, do you have to explore? Oh, really? Okay. How about condensed milk? No. <laughs> Ask chef? Okay, thank you. I think he's gonna get it. <laughs> Let's wait. Oh, you're really handsome. You look really good today. I go all the way. Um, also, how about the craziest thing you've ever done? Really? Wow, I can't even imagine. <laughs> See, I told you, you're so silly and crazy. really crazy okay so then I want to ask you um, do you have any um, what's your like favorite movie? Shawshank Redemption? I love it too okay so name five of them then like four more four more 
there will be blood. Are you joking me? You're joking. That's another one of my favorite. What? That's so funny. Okay, name three more. Titanic? Are you kidding? No, you're joking. No, you're joking. That's mine too. What? That's so funny. How about more? Two more. What? Seriously? Okay. No. Seriously? So you like Gone with the Wind and a Gladiator too? No, he's joking. <laughs> Guess what? We have same movies. Like your favorite movie, mine, they both same. Definitely. Wow. Oh my god, I want to hug you. I want to hug you. That's funny though. Um, I, I don't know what to say. Okay, then tell me what's your favorite TV show? Breaking Bad. <laughs> what? Yeah, mine too. I love it. I love it. I really love it. <laughs> I'm gentle touching your face. You're too cute. So funny. Okay, so do you have um, about horror movie? Do you like horror movie? Horror movies? No, I don't like horror movies. You like? No. Well, I get so scared, you know? I'm like so scared of horror movies and um if you can watch with me, I will watch. Because I am such a chicken. I get so scared. <laughs> That's funny. So we'll watch a movie together, okay? On Halloween? Promise? How about Pinky Promise? Do you know that? Pinky. Give me the Pinky. Stamp. Nice. So we promised together. Okay. <laughs> oh my god. I can't believe that. Um, so, how do you like the new room? New place? like different roomies I wouldn't like it I guess but um, since I have you I like it and um, how about like I, I noticed you're such you're very um, amazing human being you know you are like a character and uh, your attitude, everything is just really amazing. Where did you get the education? Oh, makes sense. Me? Homeschooling? <laughs> yeah. So my parents, yeah, I did homeschooling. Um, I don't know why they just didn't send me to school, which is sad sometimes. Yeah. Well, it's okay, because 
uh, if I had different education it would be different and a whole life would be different and I wouldn't be here with you so I'm happy do you know any other languages? really? neat um, me? no <laughs> only English <laughs> I don't know Um, never tried, you know, homeschooling again. So, <laughs> yeah. Mm. I want to say, I want to tell you, and also want to say that girl kept looking at you. And I noticed, since she was looking at you, I want to show her that you're mine. Yeah? Well, I don't want to lose you, so you're my roomie. <laughs> I'll give you another hug. about like or like dream about if you could visit some planet yeah what is it that's cool you know why <laughs> well mine um, would be same as yours so, it makes me like, get so excited um, We think same, we actually dream same And I like spending time with you Do you really think I look good today? Guess <laughs> Ah, uh, thank you. Um, because I'm... I was nervous to have a finally have a date with you. And, um, yeah, I was like... Whole time I was getting so nervous. <laughs> really? No condensed milk? Oh, that's too bad. Okay, thank you. No condensed milk. That's too bad, right? It's okay. I'll show you when we get through, okay? What's the snack? Because I always have it. Yeah. <laughs> okay, so I want to ask then. You've been to like, I like here on my lip. <laughs> um, you've been to Toronto and Ottawa. Which one you like the most? Yeah. Um, I like Ottawa. Yeah, I like Ottawa better. It's it's really amazing city, right? So. I like Toronto, it's just, uh, you know, maybe too busy and um, like the sightseeing way, I like Ottawa better Yeah, it's very beautiful, right? I almost sneezed, oh <laughs> What inspired me to live alone? <laughs> no there's no inspiration because my mom and dad kicked me out <laughs> they thought like oh you're now 25 get out and you're done educating so just kick me out 
Yeah. There's like nothing, you know? Nothing special behind it. So this, yeah, this is my second place I've been renting. So the first one, the renting, I would say the host was like not very nice and um, quiet, you know. I shouldn't say not nice, it's just very quiet. Like they don't say much, they don't talk and I don't know if they are existing or not. You know, it's just every time I come to the room alone, nobody there, and it was a little bit um, gloomy sometimes. So I wanted to change the places. Yeah, and then that's how I moved to the other side of the world, like a city. It's like opposite side, right? This side and other side. Yeah. Am I talking too much? <laughs> feel like I'm talking too much <laughs> so um yeah that's why I changed the room and I don't regret I'm happy I met you I met you I met you here so I'm happy what can't categorical imperative um I don't know. I don't know if people are following or not. What do you think? <laughs> I know it's it's so hard to tell, right? Sometimes I feel like everything is same, and then like one day you look at it, everything's different. So it's like same or like different. You know, I can't. Yeah. <laughs> Nice question now. <laughs> this is like, I like to drink flat pop because, um, two carbonated makes me hiccups. <laughs> so, I like, um, flat and, um, just, <laughs> yeah. There's another girl looking at you. You're mine. Right? <laughs> um, nice. So how about what you like to eat? What's your favorite thing to eat? Yeah? Oh. Yeah, I like it. No, I'm just a... Uh, um, just ask because cause, um, I want to order dessert because <laughs> uh, I love it I love cake so much um, so I just want to eat cake what do you think? yeah excuse me can I get a dessert menu please? thank you Which bear is the best? You mean like bear bear? Um, I don't know, maybe grizzly? Grizzly or panda bear? <laughs> I like grizzly, they just um, look humongous and strong and beautiful and also furious, you know? Um, but pandas like opposite, clumsy, cute, like you. <laughs> uh, <laughs> so, um, I want to ask also, what made you come here today? you bailed on me before oh that's sweet thank you <laughs> I 
Well, no, I was just upset because I thought you're gonna come, but you didn't, and uh, you know, I was like waiting for you. But I'm glad you came. <laughs> mm. Like, uh, so then what's gonna be your ideal day? Like, perfect day, I would say. What's a perfect day? Really? Well, mine is similar. I'd like to just, um, mine would be get up at 9, 9.30 and just slowly in bed about half an hour just stretch and do nothing and then get up, eat whatever in the fridge um, and maybe um, just um, watch the favorite TV show or movies like Marvel movies all day <laughs> that would be my perfect day <laughs> uh, like you know it sounds silly I know but since we're like always busy 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 right there'll be more relaxing mm-hmm scared if I'm gonna hit myself here, right? Well, so after I talk to you, you even feel more interesting. I really like spending time with you. <laughs> it's just, um, Somehow you like attract me a lot, I should say. <laughs> Cause um somehow I mean I just can't stop looking at you and um it's and it was like the first time when I met you. It was unforgettable. Yeah. I love it. I'm so glad you came. <laughs> um, so are we gonna go to our room? Wanna grab some Chinese food on the way? Or actually I don't want I actually want to get maybe junior chicken junior chicken, right? like four junior chicken <laughs> the reason we're getting a lot is we're gonna all go home and we're gonna watch Gone with the Wind yeah, we're gonna watch it with me because it's your favorite too, right? Yeah, can I give you another hug, please? I like hugging you so much and you smell good as always <coughs> Do you think I can take this coaster to home? We don't have coasters at home. They're not lucky, just put it in your pocket. I'm just joking. That will be fun though. And if you put it in your pocket, I'm gonna call the waiter and I'm gonna snitch on you. Cheers.
so thirsty. I feel much better. You wanna go? We can leave. Uh, what time is it? We can leave. Yeah, sure. A couple minutes. Right. When we get home, you can do the massage. I can do the massage for you. Sound good? <laughs> um, I can do massage. I'm good at it. Um, yeah, sure. Being silly, I was thinking something. Okay, let's go then. Okay, well, I can hold my hand. Your hand's so warm. more videos and if you like that click like and subscribe tickety nice to meet you tickety and welcome shall we begin let's go your families. You're not gonna come tonight, that's what you said. Holy, oh my god, I was so scared. Um, well, I'm sorry, I'm wearing a shirt. Um, I washed the clothes, you know, so do you remember the last time I told you, like, uh, we can trick the laundry machine and um, it didn't work today so um, I just decided to wash everything and I borrowed your shirt hope you don't mind <laughs> thank you oh my god um, yeah and also I washed your clothes too that was in the laundry basket um, yeah, um, also, like, I forgot to tell you, uh, you got a couple mails, um, and the package, I put them all, um, beside your bed, yeah, by the way, like, what happened, 
You said you're gonna stay with your family. Oh. Uh-huh. Oh, okay. Um, well, I'm glad I saw you, but just didn't expect. Um, I'll just very fast wash the sink. I'll be back, okay? I just put some stuff in it. Uh, just a sec. Do you, do you wanna lay on a bed? We can lay on a bed. Yeah? Okay, let's go. <laughs> so... Was the laundry is all done? Maybe not, right? Maybe I'll put some pillow over and then lay down. shirt is very comfortable it's like you know it's like my size I should just get it do you want to give it to me? <laughs> yeah it's just um well you know I saw your pile laundry pile and then uh, and then just it wasn't working right so I just decided to wash both bars might as well like just washing all of them at the same time it was make it, it just make more makes more more sense right I can't even talk anymore I just um, yeah like uh, didn't expect you to come I didn't expect you to come, so I was like red-handed. My plan was to wash your shirt by hand and once everything done and then dry it on a drying rack because um, you originally supposed to come yesterday no, tomorrow <laughs> oh my god, my brain doesn't work anymore but, um I'm glad you came. Um, like, I like spending time with you. Last time the date was really good. Right? The movie we watched. 
just after Marvel. That was good. Yeah. Well, um, I am off tomorrow. I have no work and, um, like, if you are free, we can just, um, just take it easy, you know, like, yeah, <laughs> um, pretend pretend we have nothing to do, okay? Yeah? Want me to rub your head? A little bit? Yeah, sure, I don't mind. Right there. closer to you and then uh, wrap 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 um right there Pretend we have a month of four weeks off and we can we can like talk about what we would do if we had four weeks off, you know. What do you wanna do? shift every time I did and so I was like very tired um hopefully this month not too much shift yeah because I just want to stay home and do nothing Right, that will be really fun. And, um, and I was like also thinking, um, you next time you can just combine the laundry, and I can do it at the same time. Yeah. You know what? Um, I'm very nervous. Um, I'm so nervous because 
I got red-handed wearing a shirt and I don't know what to talk about right now um, yeah I'm a bit nervous maybe I can concentrate on reading some book what do you think? I can try to calm myself down and if it helps you I can do it too This one is a kid's book. This is my little niece's book. Well, it's like four, three, three books in uh, one. And I think, I believe there was like 20 of them. 20... 20 books, I believe. I can try to read some for you. Do you want to try? Okay, since we're trying to like, um, you know, like, relax, I'll read some for you. This says Dragon Masters, okay. Dragon Masters. Dragon Masters. of the Earth Dragon, book number two, Saving the Sun Dragon, book number three, Secret of the Water Dragon. Okay. Okay. To the castle. Drake, chapter one. Drake didn't see the king's soldier coming. He was busy digging in the onion patch. He pulled out the fat white onion. A worm crawled on it. Drake didn't mind the worm. He was the son of a farmer. His family had been growing onions in the kingdom of Bracken from forever. He would spend his life digging up onions, whether he wanted or not. Drake picked up the worm. Hello, little guy. He said. Then he put the worm back in the dirt. Are you Drake? A loud voice asked behind him. Drake jumped up and turned around. One of the king's soldiers rode up on a black horse. He had a yellow beard. His shirt had a gold dragon sewn on it. The symbol of King Roland the Bold. Yes, I am Drake, Drake said, his voice shaking. Soldiers never came to the fields, not unless a farmer was in trouble. The soldier rode up to Drake. He reached down and pulled him up onto his horse. Hey, what are you doing? Drake yelled. The soldier didn't answer. Drake's mother ran out of their hut. Wait, where are you taking my son? She yelled. To King Roland, the soldier said. Drake's heart jumped a little. He had always wanted to meet the king, but he's only eight, his mother yelled. She marched up to the horse. The king has chosen him, the soldier said. Chosen me for what? Drake wondered. He knew better than to ask the soldier questions. Peasants like Drake weren't allowed to speak unless spoken to. The king will take good care of him, the soldier said. 
Then he spurred on the horse and sped off. Drake, do as the king says, his mother called out. Drake had never been on a horse before. He held on tight. Drake's heart pumped fast as they raced through the village. They raced over the stone bridge. Finally, they stopped in front of King Roland's castle. The soldier helped Drake climb down from the horse. He opened the castle door and gave Drake a shove. They passed paintings and statues and people in fancy clothes. The soldier, soldier stomped behind Drake as they walked through the halls. Drake wanted to look at everything, but the soldier gave him a push whenever he slowed down. Then they came to some stairs. They walked down, down, and down. The soldier stopped at the door. Where are we going? Drake finally asked. We are not going anywhere, the soldier said. Good luck. Then he ran back up the stairs. Hey, what do you mean? Drake yelled, but he was all alone. Drake looked at the big stone door. He felt afraid, but more than that, he was curious. He pushed it open and saw the face of a giant red dragon. Drake blinked. He didn't believe his eyes. Then whoosh, the dragon shot a huge fireball from his mouth. a little better because I was so nervous. Oh. Oh. Mm. How are you feeling? I want to drink some juice. feeling good <laughs> I can hear some rumbling I think it's neighbors walking around right yeah definitely and definitely they're walking around Just a little bit, rub, 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 like right here. Um, you know what? I talked about you with my friends, and uh, they were saying. Um, I am very lucky that I have someone I like to have my roommate. What's that noise, right? Is it people talking outside or is it neighbors? I can't tell. Can you tell? Yeah. Just, I don't know, usually... Um, usually it's like a quiet time, right? Shouldn't make any noise, but I definitely can hear something.
としてって。<笑>
the wizard warned, dragons are dangerous, and even the dragon stone can't protect you from their powers. What powers? Drake asked. The wizard led him away without another word. More dragons. Drake's mind was spinning as he left the wizard workshop. He followed Griffith to a big underground room. There were no windows. Torch hung on the walls. Drake saw Rory and Vulcan. He also saw two more kids and two more dragons. How are you feeling? Let me check. Let me check on you. Like, good. Just relax. Okay, relax. I'll be here, you know that. You can just relax, okay? Sleep. 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 Don't worry about laundry, anything. I can take care of it. Since you're here, back from your trip. I want you to relax. Good. Deal. Pinky promise? I'm gonna use my left hand, okay? Since I'm laying down. <laughs> Pinky promise and stamp. I'll do everything, don't worry. I just want you to relax now. Okay. Ready? <laughs> Drake This is Bo, Griffith said Pointing to a boy with black hair And his dragon show Bo was petting his dragon's tail This dragon had shiny blue scales But no wings Hi, Drake said Nice to meet you, Drake The boy said politely Griffith, let Drake over to a girl with long black hair. Her dra dragon had white scales. A yellow band of scales circled the dragon's neck. The tips of its wings were yellow too. This is Anna and her dragon Capri, Griffith said. Drake nodded. Hi, he said. We could use somebody new around here, Anna said. You have met the other dragon masters and the dragon. It's time for you to meet your dragon, Griffith said. Drake's heart pounded. My family will never believe this, he thought. Just this morning, I was digging onions. Now I have ridden a horse. I've met a wizard. I've seen the dragon stone. And I'm going to have my very own dragon. He and the other dragon masters followed Griffith down another dark hallway. The dragons sleep in caves when they are not training, both explained as they walked. Vulcan's cave is the biggest, bragged Rory. Griffith stopped in front of a small cave. Wood bars covered the cave. Drake, meet your dragon, the wizard said. Chapter 4 War Drake peered inside the dark cave. A dragon sat inside. Well, this creature kind of looks like a dragon, Drake thought. The dragon had brown scales that weren't shiny. He had two tiny wings. He had big green eyes and little ears. And he didn't have legs. He looked like a big snake. The only dragon-like thing about him seemed to be his long snout. Drake stepped up to the wood bars. Hi, dragon. I'm Drake. The dragon didn't move. Put on a stone, Griffith said. Drake slipped the green stone around his neck. He felt a tingly feeling all over his body. Tingly. Tingly.
Right away, Dragon lifted his head. He stared at Drake with his big green eyes. Drake felt a strange chill. Griffith stepped forward. The strange chill. The skull. Tinkle, 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 tinkle. Tinkle, tinkle, tinkle. Right? <laughs> Griffith stepped forward. You must name your dragon. He said. Uh, Rory uh, piped up. Good luck naming him. He looks boring. How about Nuddlehead? Anna asked with the giggle. Bo shook his head. No, this dragon needs a good name. Drake looked carefully at the dragon. He looked at his long brown body. Warm, he said. His name is Warm. That's a good name for an earth dragon, said Griffith. Open in the gate. Now Drake asked Warm to follow you. Okay, Drake, said Warm, please follow me. Warm crawled forward. Good work, said the wizard. Keep it up, Drake. Come on, Drake said, still starting to walk down the hallway. Warm crawled after him. He really is like a big, ugly worm, Rory said. Rory, be nice, said Anna. Drake didn't say anything. Warm was like a big worm. Where are we going? he asked. To the training room, Griffith replied. Yeah, said Rory. We'll see what you and your dragon are made of. Drake felt nervous. He touched this dragon's stone. How am I supposed to train a dragon? he thought. What if I fail? What if I'm not a dragon master after all? How are you feeling? Yeah. Well, I want you like sleep restfully. Restful. Restful. Sleep. Restful. Relax, relax, just relax. Yeah, like that. Just like that. Yeah, try to sleep. That's it. That's it. I can kind of hear sleep is around. Right. Mm -hmm. <gasps> I'm very tired. How are you, Tom? Yeah. Mm -hmm. 
get I want you like just relax and sleep have restful sleep like, like restful feels much better when you're around <laughs> 